Hey everybody, it's Eric. Hey everybody, it's Glenda. We are D&D Mentor and Board Games. So Alien, Fate of the Nos... Nos oh, God, you know, the Alien fans are going to kill me because I can't... I forgot how to okay. Nostromo. <laughs> Nostromo. Alien, Fate of the Nostromo. Highly sought after game right now. Very hard to find. Ah, hard find. We got one of the last copies at our target. You want to see what's inside? Stay tuned. So, Alien, Ravensburger, we've been hearing about this for months that they've been working on this. And finally gets released. You can get them in Target. But, as I said at the beginning, it's not an easy game to come by. Most people can't find it. Those that can, there's like a copy and they happen to get lucky and get the last one. So scarce. Cat. Wow. Well, it's Ripley's cat. Of course. In space, no one can hear you scream. Oh, wow. We have crew morale. That's pretty good. Well, it's actually a pretty good board. Alright. So, the rule book. <laughs> so one person did ask uh, about the if you could use the characters with uh, the Gale Force 9 alien game and somebody else put put one of the figures up to it they are larger than the Gale Force 9 figures well you do have a nice alien though <laughs> oh gosh, yeah. There must be a couple standees in here because oh, I see there. two standees. Oh, there are. Maybe it's time to, uh. Seriously? Time to break off part of that razor blade, maybe. Get the sharp one. Oh. Yeah, because it wasn't cutting. Alright, so. We have, I'm assuming, maybe some extra map pieces. And, oh, looks like a different style of ability to cool and canister, motion tracker, incinerator, flashlights. So you should have your board, player reference cards. You're not there yet. You have play cards. Oh, flat cards. Crew flat cards. Crew figures. Alien figures, which we already have. Morale markers. I'm going to assume that we have different scenarios. There's five. Missions. Mission cards. Five mission cards. All right. Now you said these were uh, character what? You should have five player reference cards. Uh, Rippy, Rippy, Ripley, Dallas, Brett, Parker, and Lambert. Cool. And in your, uh, I know you were talking about the reference, quick reference cards. You should have five of those. Considering that you can play up to five, five. players, right? Mm -hmm. Alright, so we do have five quick reference cards. And so we have objective cards and encounter cards. Let's take a look at these objectives. Uh, we'll take our chances in the shuttle, give it a little incentive. Shouldn't have landed on this on this ball. Check the hypersleep chamber. 
Where is it? Crew meeting. Prep suits. Drive them into the airlock. What's the damage? And encounter the nest. Yes, I can. And then we have the encounter cards. Uh, alien hunt. Alien stalk. Uh, loss of signal. Quiet. 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 Order 937. Order 937. Order 937. So, for those of you who don't know, this is actually based on the first Alien movie. Uh, the Gale Force 9 is based on the second, which is Aliens. And you will be seeing 360 degree views of those miniatures if you already didn't see them. And that is Alien. Support your local gaming. We support. It's Garwick Games in Fayetteville, Georgia. Game on, everybody. Game on.